Now we shall learn using editor templates. We are going to continue the same project that we have been using till now and will demonstrate how to use editor templates with the same project. First of all, let us understand why do we need to use editor templates or why are we wishing to use it. If you consider this form that we are doing right now, it has two fields, one for the name and one for the phone. The same form can be used at two places. The first is when you are creating a new record. The second is when you are updating information when you are editing information. This means this form has to be used at two places. So we must template it out so that it is created at one place and used again and again in the project. This is the reason why we would need a template here. You can always check out your project for places where templating would be possible. Generally it is possible where you want to use a form or a view at more than one place. So let us now see how templating is done in MVC. For this we shall go to the solution explorer. right click on the home folder, the folder for our controller, right click, add new folder called editor templates. This name is hard coded into MVC. You cannot change the spellings of this folder. Don't change the spellings. No spell change. Because this is a part of the MVC framework. We shall place all templates of the home controller in this folder. So let us now right click and add, add new item. So we can add a partial page, give it any name. We will give it a name create user temp template. Okay, give any name and click add. So we have used a partial page so that nothing is written in it, in it previously. Otherwise, we would have been required to delete it. Now, coming back to this. Let us suppose we want this part of the code to be templatized. We have cut it and taken it here, formatting it and at the top we should write the model. right for the model. And once you add this at the rate model at the top, all errors vanish and this part becomes an editor template for us. We could have picked 